Okay, hello, this is Nellie Jean again. Um, reviewing another product, and lucky you guys, it's a good review. And it is Dr. Ho's uh, Pain Therapy, and it has four pads. Um, this one costs a bit. Um, I, I got this um, from Crush Sale, actually, and it wasn't even open. It was all completely sealed and stuff. But the original person paid around $220. I think they might be going down in price now. Um, but I got all the goodies then, so I can show you. Um, so this, it says it fixes back pain. Um, I think it does help and loosen things. Um, I've had to, I've had with stress, I'm one of those people that gets like a big knot in my shoulder and then it just kind of slowly radiates and ruins your whole back where you're just so tense. That's just how I handle, hold my stress. So with this... It doesn't take away the pain, but um, uses like electric electricity. It's on your skin. Your skin conducts electricity a little bit, and it like contracts your muscles like that. And um, you know, like let's say you're trying to study or something. That's where I mostly need it, and where I was happy I actually bought it. Is you can't focus because your back hurts. Um, like Tylenol, ibuprofen doesn't. It might help a little bit, but it's, it's still just stiff. I find I can just put this on when you're like, your back's just hurting and you can, you can do other things. You can get up, go out and about. You're not like stuck in bed, you know, trying to distract yourself watching TV or something. This is excellent. Uh, I know two other people that use, uh, these. One person, I'm not sure what brand she used, but my sister uses another brand and she found it was good. Uh, I think hers broke. I haven't had, I don't use this that much. Like I'll just go through like maybe a week I'll use it a lot and then I just won't use it for, so I don't know for wear and tear how good it is, but I know my sister for her other kind of different brand of this, it, she used it lots and it did really well. Like the things that's going to wear out, I think, cause this is like a super simple design. Um, mine's like a big thing of wires here. Um, What's going to wear out is these little pads. I just stuck it to this case because it comes with little clear things that you can lose <laughs> that it sticks to. But you just want to stick this to a smooth surface doesn't, so it doesn't get all dirty. And um, this one has like two spots on the top so you can plug in two sets of these pads. Um, and then there's three different modes and, uh, and then there's like a timer. I usually just set it for max and then if I want to take it off or turn it off. Um, and then you can fiddle with the volume here sometimes with different settings. Um, I don't like all the settings they have, like the different massage features. That's the thing too. If you can try different brands to see what massage features you like, cause I've let other people borrow this and there's one I like and they just hate it. So, cause there's like one that's like a chopping and then one that's more like kind of like a kneading and then they change a little bit cause otherwise you kind of get bored of the same feeling. And certain ones, um, you want to change the level because otherwise it can hurt. And especially if these dry off, like you put them on and let's say you had to move it again, it might not stick as well. And when it doesn't stick as well, you might get like a pinching feeling versus the nice like chopping or kneading or, you know, your muscles twitching kind of, um, you don't want the pinching feeling. So sometimes you just have to go to the tap. I just dab the tap and then just wait for it and uh, just moisten it and then let it dry for like two seconds very quick and then just put it where you want it because if you adjust it you know skin sticks to it a little bit and then it just doesn't quite stick to you as good and then you can get that little starry tingling pinchy feeling it's not that great um yeah so it's pretty good um i like to leave it on longer than you know even 40 minutes like i'll have this on for an hour i've had it where i you can just i used it lots in one day because when you're it doesn't like fix your back pain but it makes it so you you can still function and um I know one person she uses this for her feet um I don't really particularly like it that much but she loves it because she's on her feet all day she's like a, a cook in a restaurant so she's standing all day and so she uses things that are kind of, I'm not sure like it's exactly like these but I think they are but she really really likes them and I've tried them they're okay um uh, I think it'd be better if I was more flat footed. I think maybe I have a higher arch too. And I find it's a little more tingly. Like it just doesn't stick. 
Like, I'd rather use one of these kind of pads on my feet. That's just me. But she really likes it because otherwise she'd be... Like, what I, I've even worked jobs where uh, you just have to put your feet up immediately after work. Otherwise, you're just done for the day. She was able to use this for, like, half hour. She uses this, like, daily. And she's good to go, like, after. She can continue on with her day after she's done work and go out and about and walk and stuff like that. So... That is a good thing, but I haven't found that success myself, but, you know, try things. Um, it comes with some bigger pads, so larger surface area. I haven't used them because I kind of like to, I don't know, wear things out one thing's first. And these have been kind of good too, but wider surface area. I would probably like these once I start using them, but I just haven't. Um, they come with these um, and this. Uh, I haven't really used them that much. I think I watched the video like a while ago because it comes with a nice CD um, explaining things. It comes actually with quite a bit of stuff. Actually, I'll show you everything. So, it comes with a lovely case and it comes with some extra wires for hooking up the feet things and whatnot. And then it comes with uh, two different sets of little pads. So there's like two in this bag, two in this bag, and then I got four here and then two large uh, pads and these things and then the feet and then also comes with um, what these pads were originally stuck to they're clear plastic and then they were stuck in these which I just don't use because I'm lazy and I don't want to have to go find them after I've used them and then they come with their own little case you can put them in but I don't use that because it's, it's, it's nice if there's a case but I, I just don't use it and the box that it came in looks like so. Very nice box. And that's fascinating. And then it comes with a bunch of pamphlets information, which is handy. Uh, French and English um, and the owner's manual and stuff like that. Um, very good. I've just watched the video for him. Or you can just kind of... I'd watch the video, but I'm, I'm thorough like that. I'm one of those people that likes reading instructions, but otherwise you can kind of just figure it out. Um, I think the only thing with this, the for safety wise, is you're not supposed to put it on your face. And uh, I don't think you're supposed to put it up high on your neck or anything, and you're not supposed to put it over your heart. So putting it on your back, on your spine and stuff like that, it just don't put it right above your heart because it's a little bit of electricity, and I think it's just like, I don't know do anything. I don't know if maybe if a pacemaker, but safety first people. And so it comes with some little information. So this one's like the pressure points of the foot, which is kind of cool. Um, oh yeah. And it says what these dual, okay. This one's the, oops, sorry, grabbed the wrong one. This one here, a little module. It's called the Acupine Stimulator. Ooh. Uh, it's basically for taking away uh, for insect bites and itching. So it's supposed to take that away. And it's supposed to help, help open the sinus cavity. Apply it to the nasal indentations and on the side of the nose or the indentation on the eyebrow. So I'm assuming right here. Uh, maybe applied to pressure points, blah, blah, blah. I think that's what these. this is for. Pressure points and stuff. And on the feet. So I think you can kind of use this whatever. I haven't used it for insect bites. I've insect bites. I've never. I haven't thought really thought of that. It might help myself. I think. You know, have you ever tried the method where you just put an X with your nail on insect insect bites? I think that works. I have a feeling this wouldn't work as well, but maybe. Uh, and then these ones. These are kind of cool. I haven't used them. But you're supposed to use aloe vera. I think I did try them once, but they were, yeah. But, you know, it's better than nothing. Uh, this is for facial toning. And then it says TMJ. I'm not sure what that means. And Bell's palsy. Yeah, so it's supposed to use, use in mode C. So there's mode C. It's ABC for the modes that are covered up by this sticker here. And uh, you can just do some facial toning with this. So it'll probably be handy on the neck and stuff. I haven't used it. I kind of mostly just bought it because every once in a while you kind of get stiff. And 
sometimes you have different forms of back pain, so you need to try different things. So for me, I find I can function, you know, if you're debilitated, just leave this on and you can function. And after a while, like I've usually like a half day, it does loosen things up, but it's not as impressive as they make it seem. But the thing is that it, it's a good product. It doesn't take away pain, but it, it, it gives you a different sensation, you know, if something really hurts, like if some, uh, it's kind of like if you get a flu shot and it hurts. Sometimes if you rub it really quick right away, that kind of like helps because it's messing. You're feeling other things. You're not just feeling that one sensation. So this is good and it moves things up, you know, because you don't always have someone that can give you a massage and get in there and like, and it's, it doesn't hurt. Like as like, the only thing that could maybe hurt is if it's dry, like it's drying off a little bit, or you, like, removed it. It can be a little pinchy, which isn't good. And sometimes where you put it, sometimes the when your back's, like, moving like that, it can be kind of annoying. So just adjust it so different muscles are twitching. Like, you'll figure out where you want it to. It works pretty good. So it's something you could live without, but if you got a little spending money and you have back pain... It helps and even foot pain as one friend knows and um, yeah like my sister she used it so much like this she had another brand from how many years ago she had been in a couple car accidents and her it was it, yeah she's getting other things now like she went physio and all that stuff but initially before she had all that stuff and cortisone I think it was shots this this helped her get through things like and I have to say, I get so stiff from studying and stuff for school. So this is helpful. So it's not perfect. doesn't take away pain, but it certainly kind of like helps. So that's my review. And if you have any questions, I'll try to answer them. But uh, it also has informational CD when you do buy it. And I find other information online, but that's the basics that you need to know. It's, it's pretty good. It doesn't take away or cure pain. It just kind of helps with the time and kind of might loosen things up a little bit. Anyway, thanks. This was Nellie Jean.